Uh, let's move on to the uh, eye. Uh, women face a 40% greater risk than men of having jobs replaced by AI. Now, you've written extensively about this. Yes, I not? have I have written about this. And yes, uh, mm -hmm. this, is, this is an IPPR uh, bit of research. And it says uh, that 11% of the tasks being done by workers in the UK are already vulnerable to replacement with with AI, but it's particularly jobs that, that women might be doing. I have to say something, which is that all of our jobs... But you're not real. Unless... No, I'm not real. <laughs> but all of our jobs are being threatened by AI, unless I think you're a makeup artist or a hairdresser, um, which I think are the last things that the robots yeah. will, will take over. All of our jobs are at risk. And I think in the, in the immediate term, according to this, women uh, face 40% greater risk. Do we, do, we, so do we know which sort of jobs just... Um, and this is the Institute for Public so Policy one, So one of the big yeah. examples they talk about is secretarial work within the NHS, uh, which is a large cohort, mostly of women. Of course, a, lot of, a large amount of manual labour is performed overwhelmingly by men, which mm. would be much later to be replaced by AI. So that might skew uh, the statistics here. Nobody really talks about the gender imbalance in road repairs or, uh, and so forth. So, um, you know, there are jobs that are more likely to stay um, being done by people. But if you look, at the other hand, at entry-level jobs in law firms, which wow. historically have been photocopying and built into your precedent collection uh, and so forth, AI is really very good at that sort of AI thing. will also be good at being lawyers quite soon. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> because they'll be able to process But it's already the... taken over some forms of accountancy, hasn't sure. it? It's so taking over so... everything, yeah. basically. Yeah, golly. Except for things that human beings have to do with their hands. In the meantime, we're told we have to work to 68, which in the present circumstances with AI taking the jobs might, be, might prove difficult. Any